Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today what we're going to do is actually test if adding more RAM gives you a better gaming experience. But definitely adding more RAM gives you a better experience in multitasking application or maybe multiple tabs or multiple browser. But our main focus for today is just to test if we add this RAM to our computer and it will give us a better gaming experience. And for our computer, we will be using this HP ProDesk 600G5 which is i5-9500T 6-core 6 6-thread 6 processor. This one has a 8GB of RAM and we are running an SSD for our main hard drive. And this one doesn't have a dedicated GPU for games. And without further ado, let's try to test our performance on CSGO and Dota 2. Okay guys, and for CSGO, we are configuring this CSGO at 720p resolution and everything is set to medium because we have tried before a full screen or a 1080p resolution and the result is not actually good. On this one, we can actually play and let's try to check the FPS we are getting on CSGO. Okay guys, and our resolution is somewhere around 17 to 15. We even dip at 15 FPS and our max are at around 26 FPS. Okay, and the resolution is actually okay. It took a while to load and as you can see, it is not working well. We are having a hard time trying to play this game even in a window mode. And the settings, let us try to check the settings. And the video is actually set to uh, the second one, the basic settings. But we're going to try to check if we can set it to the fastest configuration. And just Changing the configuration on this one is actually taking some time. And we have configured this one to the basic settings or the fastest one. And let's try to check the gaming experience again. And it is still lag. Okay, and as you can see, I'm trying to click everywhere and it's not allowing me to follow the graphics on this one. And as you can see, it's not a decent game. Okay, and it's getting better, I think. And there you go. As you can see, it is not the best of the gaming experience that we're encountering, but we're going to test on adding an additional RAM for this one. And guys, we're going to open this new Patriot 8GB of RAM and try to add this one on our computer. And there you have it. We have installed the 8GB of RAM and try to turn on this computer and try to check again if we have a better gaming experience now since we added an additional 8GB of RAM. Guys, this is the first time we're going to test CSGO with a 16GB of RAM. And it seems the performance is better than the 8GB of RAM. And it increases significantly. We are around 51. 47 to 51 FPS, we are almost double the speed which we have earlier ago at around 16 to 26 FPS or we are hitting double for this additional memory. And it's a good thing. 
can see that that's a headshot and because we have a better X fps compared to the last one earlier and okay okay you can see that one and we have a better experience compared to the other one and it's almost or double the fps that we're getting from the previous configuration i see it seems to improve over time on dota 2 uh, we are getting better experience actually compared to the previous one or the early loading of the game Okay, and if you are uh, watching carefully, you'll be you'll notice that we have a better playing experience a while ago. We have a lag, which is really horrible. And there you have it, guys. You have seen the performance. Actually, by adding an additional 8 gig of RAM, it gives us a better gaming experience on CS:GO and Dota 2. For CSGO from 16 to 26 FPS at 18 memory, we are able to reach at around 40 to 50 plus FPS on 16 gigs of RAM. But for Dota 2, uh, we encountered some lags as well, but it is better compared to the one that we are using 8 gigs of RAM. The lags are better or lesser when we are using the 16 gigs of RAM. RAM for our computer and one of the reasons why we are having a great experience or greater performance when we added an additional 8 gig of RAM is we don't have a dedicated graphics card for our computer and that means that the additional 8 gig is on the pull up memory and it will be shared by the CPU and the graphics chip on this computer so if you don't have a dedicated graphics card add an additional RAM and it might help it might help on some games like the one we have played earlier it will or might help you on your gaming experience and I think that's all guys I hope you learned something from the test that we have done and I hope you like the video if you do don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe button as well if you're not yet subscribed and if you have comment and suggestion comment down below or message me at JK Chavez I'll try to answer as much as I can. And thank you for watching guys. Have a great day. Stay safe and bye.